Hello, my name is Findimus, and in this video we're going to be learning about radio buttons and checkboxes, checking them by default. Drink it some water. If you want to follow along, the link is in the description down below. Let's begin. You can set a checkbox or radio button to be checked by default using the checked attribute. To do this, just add the word checked to the inside of an input element. For example, you have this input element radio, and at the end here it says checked. Set the first of your radio buttons and the first of your checkboxes to both be checked by default. So we need to find the first radio button and so if you go down you can see the type is radio and name test name so after value we're just gonna put check while I drop my mouse and we're going to go down to the box loving. You can kind of look over here and see it. So down for loving, we're going to put checked as well. So here you have loving, value, loving. So we'll just put checked. And now you can see that it's automatically checked. You can change it, but by default it starts off checked. And that was the objectives for this challenge. Let's run the test. It's alive. It's alive. Frankenstein was the monster. Or was he the doctor? You should read it and find out. Okay. So thank you for completing this challenge. We are 89% of the way through with basic HTML course. Uh, it's the section not the entire course and it's outro time thank you for watching if you feel this video was helpful or you liked it then click the like button if you want to see more content like this then subscribe and if you have any questions leave them down in the comments I am Finimus I will see you later have a good day everyone